Chef Cyril Corbel is about to show us how to make Magrette du Canard à l'Ambéré à Choux. De Choux. Oui. Is that correct? Ça, oui. Oui. Uh, what that is, is it's duck, and he's going to take the breast, the fillet of duck, and he's going to uh, make that with uh, cabbage and a butter sauce. So that's uh, the English translation for that title. So we start with the um, duck. Oui, alors je vais vous présenter l'ensemble des produits euh, pour la recette. Vous avez donc euh, les choux pour l'embeurrer. Vous avez vu some of the green cabbage. Ouais, je... Et là, vous avez les, le canard. And that's the duck. And as you see, that's the whole duck. And uh, one breast per person, so that's enough for two people. Les oignons, ça c'est les produits qu'on a déjà un petit peu préparés. Hein? He's going to, you know, take this, cover off the onions and slice them. Vous avez les fines herbes. Ah, that's uh, chives. Les ingrédients euh, d'assaisonnement. So then he has a little butter, a little pepper, a little salt, a little wine, and a little, uh, right in here, some water with a um, bouillon cube, chicken, voilà, chicken bouillon. Et maintenant, on va commencer par euh, couper les, préparer les choux. And now he's going to show us how to prepare the cabbage. He's going to cut that and slice that and clean ah. it. Voilà. What he's doing is he's taking all the outer layers off first. He just cuts that stem off. You have to make sure that you clean it very well because as you can see, there's a lot of dirt in here. Donc euh, on ne garde pas le, le vert. Hein? On va garder uniquement les parties jaunes. Uh, so this is the part of the cabbage he's going to use. Voilà. Également, on va l'enlever. Just taking another one of the harder layers off. He wants the inside of the cabbage. Ça, on enlève le cœur, hein, qui est trop, trop dur. So he's taking the heart out of it. Voilà. Yeah, you don't want that part. Donc ça, on va le laver. Hein? On s'en va le... We're going to put that in the water and wash that. Voilà. Donc ça, voilà. Donc là, ça va bien ce qu'on arrête parce que comme ça, je vais reprendre l'autre et on va pouvoir les masser. Hein? Voilà. Donc maintenant, on va les masser. Hein? Cyril's doing is he's going to slice this very thinly. And as you can see, he's using the very light leaves of the cabbage. He's discarded the dark green color and he's using the light tender leaves. As you can see, slicing that very thinly. You can also, if you have a food processor, you can put this in the food processor and slice and grate it very thinly. Hopefully I can learn to do that as quickly as you do. Du côté, hein, c'est bon. Voilà. Ça va l'enlever. Maintenant, je vais éplucher les oignons. Hein, Now he's going to prepare the onions. Les oignons. He's using a little paring knife to peel the onion. Ça nous donne ça, on prend ça, et on va les émincer pour, euh, pour les lambeurer. So he sliced the onion in half, and now he's slicing it in very thin slices, and then he's going to mince it. He wants it in very fine, very small voilà. little pieces. C'est ciselé exactement. See how he's done that? He's cut it in three different layers, and then he's just cut down, and it gets you this little fine pieces of onion. Voilà. 
Donc voilà, c'est bon. Now you can see what he's doing right now. This is the Maghreb de Canard. This is the fillet, the flank, it's the breast portion of the duck. And this is the portion of the duck you want to use for this dish. Now, if you don't want to do this yourself, you can ask your butcher to do this, and he can cut this for you and give you the Maghreb de Canard. Now he's taking the vein out of the duck. And he's cutting a little bit of the fat off it. He's cutting a little more of it off. You see, he's cutting that skin off, the white part. He's now preparing to cook the duck. He's put in a little bit more than a tablespoon of oil, and with that he puts in about a tablespoon of butter. And he has a flame on very hot. I'm going to pepper the duck, putting a little bit of salt. He turns it over and does the same thing on the other side. On va commencer à les cuire du côté peau. Now he's putting the duck into the pan, skin side down first. Allez, c'est trois minutes de ce côté-là. Après, on va les retourner afin qu'ils colorent. He's going to cook it for three minutes on the one side, and then he's going to turn it over and cook it another three minutes. Now he's added the oil to the butter. That's so that the butter doesn't burn, but the butter gives it that wonderful flavor. Now he turns it over and he's cooking it on the other side. He wants it to be golden on both sides. Ah, French music, French cooking. <laughs> Donc maintenant on va retourner les canards. Now he's turning the duck over. On va les arroser. And he's going to baste it with the juices, with the butter and the oil and the juices from the duck. Pour qu'il puisse colorer un petit peu plus. Voilà. And now he's turned the flame down some, and he's going to cook it for 20 minutes. 10 minutes on one side, 10 minutes on the other. Voilà. Voilà, donc j'ai commencé. Je mets le beurre pour les pour les choux. Now the chef has put our pan on a low flame, and now he's adding oh, a couple of tablespoons of butter. Donc je vais assaisonner. But first, he puts a little choux. salt on our cabbage, voilà. which is about a cup of shredded cabbage. Voilà. Ah, on va aller mettre le gaz un petit peu plus fort. Voilà. Oh, now he's turned the flame up a little. Pour faire fondre le beurre au moins. <laughs> Ça va être un petit peu long. On va commencer par mettre les, les oignons. Hein? Going to put the onion. And that's one onion chopped and minced very fine. Then he adds the onion. Voilà, on met les oignons. Ça prend une spatule, Antoine. On va baisser un petit peu le feu. Hein? Now he's going to turn the flame down a little, so the onion doesn't cook too much. Ils ne vont pas colorer. And you want the onion to stay very white in color. You don't want it to get brown. Un peu de fond, pour qu'il fonde un petit peu. Now he mixes it around so it cooks evenly. And now we're going to add the cabbage. Voilà, maintenant on va rajouter les, les choux. And remember, he's turned the flame down, so this is cooking very slowly. On va les mélanger avec les oignons. You mix that with the onions. On va laisser fondre un petit peu. Et ensuite, on va rajouter un petit peu de vinaigre de vin. And now he's going to add a little bit of wine vinegar. Now 
was cooking this cabbage just enough so it's not real hard, but it has a, a little crunch to it still. It's not very soft. No good. Ah. Voilà. Now you add the vinegar. Suffisamment. Now our chef is going to add about three tablespoons of a bouillon three and a half, a bouillon consommé. Now you can make this with a bouillon cube and water. You can get that at any store. Uh -huh. And now he's adding about three and a half ounces of butter. Ah, he's turning down the flame a little. We don't want this to burn and we don't want it to stick to the pan. Voilà, maintenant ils ont cuit. Ils sont finis. Hein. Ils ont cuit pendant 7 ou 8 minutes, à peu près. Donc on va les pousser. On va s'occuper euh, du canard par lui-même, hein, pour le dresser. I was going to place the cabbage in the middle of the plate. La est chaude. Hein. Warm. You should put this in the oven and warm this up a little because you want this meal to be very hot. It should be served very hot. Show it. Uh -huh. He's patting that down so that then he's going to put the duck on top of that. Now we're going to cut the canard. He's going to slice the duck. And as you can see, he's slicing this very thin. About a quarter of an inch. And he's slicing it diagonally. Now he's sliced. Now we'll dress it. Now, as you can see, he's arranging the duck on the plate in a very nice pattern. And he's put. Any of the, all the fat is on the side that's down, so you can't see that once you've placed the other duck on top of it. Voilà. Voilà. That's ici. Uh -huh. Now he's decorated that nicely. He's put the slices there, and then the end piece right there. On met un petit peu de, de poivre sur le, le canard uniquement. He's going to put a little fresh ground pepper on top. On va rajouter les, la ciboulette et le cerfeuille. Sprinkling on little fresh chives. And he's garnishing it with some fresh parsley. Voici. Très bon. Pour moi? Oui. Oh, that is beautiful. Oh, that's wonderful. And you can make this also with a breast of chicken or a breast of turkey if you if duck isn't available. But I didn't know that I could make a, a dish made with duck so easily. That's beautiful. May I taste it? Oui. Oui? Uh, yeah. Use it. Voilà. Okay. Mm. Ooh. Oh, that's delicious. Oh, Cyril, this is a delicious dish. If my husband weren't watching, I might give you a kiss. <laughs>